What's up guys, this is a quick tutorial for making something that plays consecutive sounds on triggers. In this example I'm going to be making a button that has sound effects that raise in pitch. Okay, so go ahead and make a new script. I name mine Musical Button, then attach it to your object. Now open up the script and make three public audio clips. I name mine Clank, Clank 2, and Clank 3. Next, make a public int called Pitch Clip. This can also be private or name something else if you want. Next, in the start method, we're going to set pitch clip to zero. And then in the update method, we're going to do an if statement and say if pitch clip is greater or equal to three, then pitch clip is set to zero. Now you're going to make a new method called public void on mouse down. The first thing you're going to add is pitch clip plus plus, which is going to increase pitch clip by one on each click. And finally, we're going to make three if statements, one for each sound effect. First, if pitch clip is equal to one, then audio source dot play clip at point parentheses clank comma camera dot main dot transform dot position close parentheses semicolon. Now repeat that again, but with pitch clip equal to two and clank two, and a final time with pitch clip greater than or equal to three and clank three. And that is it for code. If you're following along exactly, you will also need to add a collision box to your button, an audio source, three different sound effects to drag into the inspector and an audio listener on your camera. And you should have everything you need. This can easily be used to play sounds on collision like in Peggle or can be done with an array, but I'll leave that for another video.